Persona 3 Reloaded. Hey, so... Sorry it's through the door, but can I ask you a question? Is there something you believe in, Espresso-kun? Something that, even when everything is terrible and you've been betrayed by everyone, doesn't shake your conviction? Oh, shit. Oh, no. After the stuff that we just learned about her, she's asking us this? Oh, boy. Um, you answer the wrong, you know, way here. Bad ending, you know? <laughs> there is, yeah. You're very strong. I wish I was like you. Oh, my God. Aha, I had an idea. I had an idea. Ah, looking at pictures of grandfather, is it? And there are all kinds of decorations on the shelf. On either side are pictures of a woman and a stern looking man. I wonder who they are. Hmm. Say. I, I, I didn't mean to hide anything. I simply told you what I what you needed to know and omitted the details I deemed unnecessary. My apologies. But I should stop making excuses. Regardless of my reasons, there's no denying that I kept some information secret. I... I was hiding it. Hmm... Someone has burnt the coffee! And it wasn't me! Yes! Oh, hello there. Now tell me, what shall it be? No, I'd like to know my future. Then let us begin. Guns scattered in the billowing shadow. Arms reach in to grasp them. Their muzzles pointed at different shadows. Their triggers pulled on different occasions. Where do you point your gun? What will occur as a result of its firing? Can you collect all the guns that have been scattered? Let us hope that you find fortune in your destiny. The guns! Wait, the guns! The guns! The guns are huge! Wait a minute! The neutral special! No, but, but really! I, I need to feel the beat. I need to I need to get into the spotlight here. One man. His mind was cast aside. It was as if time was frozen. All these people around me like zombies. And then this fucking bitch just somehow found something to dance for. But anyway, the people around me frozen in time. <laughs> as something came to. The guns. Where did the guns come from? I'm cooking outside the kitchen! It's true! It's possible! Well, no, obviously they came from the Kitty Joe group, but the idea that we have access to, I shoot this gun, and while it's a cool artistic, you know, expression of we're rebelling, we're doing something edgy and, you know, intense and stuff, but just the idea that we have access to them means that there are other guns. Like, they wouldn't give us all of them. So there's at least, and I mean at least like a few others out there that are being used by other people who, well, have a reason to use them, clearly. I, oh, it hurts my brain, but just the idea of like, the themes that they're establishing in the story right now is that we have a dark shadowy organization that did a crazy thing in the past. Like that's, that's a tried and true formula for a very specific type of antagonistic force. If you're going to then have evidence of that organization's um, prowess be displayed in the story, but not drawn with like a big highlighter over it, you show it in the visuals and in the background and in just kind of in the, the goings on of the main characters. Case in point, the guns. They're the things that we see over and over again, but they are there mostly to facilitate just a visual, fun, punchy, Wow, look, they're cool, they're, they're intense, wow. But no, just the idea that we just recently supplied an evoker to, um, um, to Fuka. Like we just added a new member and it was easy. It was just like, oh yeah, here's an evoker. Here you go. I'm getting the vibe that we're set up for a, another kind of, either another person joining the party, which is, you know, it's gotta happen at some point, but we could also have the thing where it's the, oh, those three that were shown there, they could have access to personas and or evokers and stuff like that, given that, yes, Back Alley Jesus has the actual, you know, revolver there that definitely doesn't look like a, it's, it's an evoker. But the idea of having like other persona users out there that could be antagonists or a part of that organization and stuff just feels like it makes sense. And then the fact that we have for this section of the game, the fortune teller specifically bring up 
guns scattered, arms reach in to grasp them. Billowing shadow sounds like a cloud, a dark storm cloud of something. The sun being obscured, the night. Um, guns are scattered, meaning there's many, there's so many, they're in different areas, they can't necessarily be found. Many people try to use them. Muzzles pointed in different directions, different reasons, different occasions. But where will we, where and how will we use ours? I... <laughs> it's good to see you again. Hi! Yep, the sleep paralysis demon is here, hello! Oh God. How long has it been since we first met? Time passes so quickly. So tell me, how's life as a Persona user? You tell me! What? God, everything now, I don't, I don't trust anything now. The last stream completely fucked how I'm perceiving this game. Completely changed how I'm seeing this game. Like that's such a weird question to ask. You've been so creepy and and now you're like, so like, you know, what what's it like? I don't know. It's whatever. <laughs> Something's missing. I wonder what. I hope you find it soon. I remembered something else about the coming of the end. It all stems from something that took place many years ago. Cool. Ten okay. years ago. Yeah. If I remember correctly. Okay. Oh, didn't your parents pass away about ten years ago? No way. <sighs> okay. Okay. A persona is like a mirror. Yeah. Which means a persona user can never escape their true self. But no matter what, I won't leave you because we're friends, right? <laughs> yeah, this definitely qualifies as a rank two. <laughs> Let, let's go. This is the most rank two, rank two. <laughs> oh, rank three. Wait, what? Did I hallucinate? I thought we were on rank one with death. De oh no. Oh no. Good night. My, my sleep paralysis demon just broke a fundamental rule of per Persona games. I'm more scared about the rank up twice than actually about whatever the kid just said. <laughs> okay, exams are starting tomorrow. Are you all ready? Summer vacation is just within reach, so you'd better study hard. Why aren't you excited? You know, summer vacation, beaches, shaved ice, woohoo! It's also the hottest time of the year though. Don't go overheating, okay? Ah, oh, that reminds me, there's an old expression for the hottest time of the year in the Northern Hemisphere. I'm feeling sleepy. No, stay awake. Wow. You need that knowledge. The dog days of summer. It goes all the way back to an ancient Latin phrase, the puppy days. Any idea where that phrase came from? Anyone? Well, it's because Sirius, also called the dog star, appears at the start of summer. People believed it, through, believed it brought droughts and misfortune. Here's hoping we can avoid all that, I guess. Have a nice vacation. I force myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Okay. Retain info, retain info. Oh, oh hi. I've been waiting for you. Can we play now? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Yay, thank you. So today... Takoyaki. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, I think I know now. Yeah? What's that? What's that? I'm gonna go with Mom. Oh. She can't cook or clean or do anything on her own. <laughs> She's laughing. So She's I'm laughing. I'm there to help her. I think Dad's oh. gonna be okay by himself. He can get along fine without me. Oh, that's so, so sweet. Um, Mom and Aww. I are gonna move away soon. Oh. Hey, Aww. even if I'm gone, we'll still be friends, right? Yeah, friends forever. Oh, this is so precious, yes. Mm -hmm. Friends mm -hmm. forever. Ever and ever and ever, okay? Oh. <laughs> you can't forget about me. Never. 
Okay. I promise. Maiko seems very fond of me. I feel like we're growing closer. Rank 9. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. I gotta get ready to move. Oh. See you later. Okay. After saying goodbye to my guy, head back to the dorm. Oh, well, that was so short, though. Rank eight was way more like intense, but oh, oh. Welcome back. Awkward. <sighs> yeah. What's wrong? You all hungry or something? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he goes like, he's doing the classic anime bro thing where he's like, what is it, constipation or something? <laughs> like, I don't know what it is with anime, anime <laughs> characters being like, what is it, are you constipated? Like, like, they, they, they ask the dumbest questions of like, clearly you're not feeling well. Are you unable to shit yourself? Is that is that the issue? Like 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 is that that like Akihiko's having the same thing, but it's it's Akihiko coded. So he's like, are you unable to uh you know acquire the means to sate yourself of hunger? Uh, I can absolve. I can you know I can I can solve this for you if you if you'll let me. I'm going to make sure you get your chicken and your rice and your broccoli. And uh, no, there will not be any salt on it. Salt helps you retain water. And and no, you need to be sweating that out. <laughs> mm, not really. Yeah. An awkward silence fills the room. Um. I would love to have like one of those, like, one of these Persona games, at some point, have there be some kind of, like, limited ability to mind read at times. And you just get to, limited at times, think about what's, you get to see what's going on in their head. That would be so funny for these kinds of moments, where it's just, like, Fuka's like, I hope they don't hate me for coming in and, you know, potentially, you know, potentially disrupting things. And then, you know, Yukari is like, Ugh, Mitsuru, why did she lie to us? I Did I cause the group dynamic to fall apart by confronting this? Junpei's just confused about his place and everything. Mitsuru's feeling all his guilt. And Miko, meanwhile, Akihiko's like, I think I have leftovers in the, uh, the fridge. What are they going to go bad? No, I can eat them tomorrow. Like, I, I don't have to eat them tonight. Yeah, I can, I can eat them tomorrow. Maybe I should share. No, no, I don't need to share. I think I think I, I think everybody's good. Like like that's that's exactly what's going on in his head right now. He's he's not he's not thinking about any of this as awkward or anything. Like <laughs> You know, it's almost summer break. <laughs> oh yeah. It is, huh? Does anyone have any plans? Way to go, Fuka. Yeah. I wish I could go to the beach. <gasps> Sand, cool breeze. <laughs> Babes in bikinis. Man, a break like that sure would be nice. Somewhere in the south, where the water is crystal clear. Okay, Jinpei, but yeah. Starting tomorrow, we gotta but get after, to after, yeah. Oh man, this sucks. Come on, yeah. I'm sure Follow that line. Fine. Let's it go. It would be nice to go somewhere with beautiful beaches, like Okinawa. <gasps> well, it's not Okinawa, but how about Yakushima? Oh? Mr. Chairman, I didn't realize you were here. I happen to be in the area, so I thought I'd drop by and tell you my schedule for next week. Okay. Oh, Hirijoku, your father will be vacationing in Yakushima during the break. Hmm. He... he will? Interesting. You'll all have some time off after exams, right? Why don't you go and get a nice change of scenery? Okay. Seriously? We're gonna go okay. On a yes. Beaches and bikinis. Beaches and bikinis. <laughs> okay, Beaches that was delivered bikinis. perfectly. This guy. I mean, come on, come on. <laughs> like, come on, <laughs> like. Well, my father is come a busy on. <laughs> man. I don't want to ruin his vacation. <laughs> Why so hesitant? No father would be upset with a daughter who came all that way to see him. You've all done a great job. 
You deserve to relax for a while. This father would indeed be upset with his daughter for arbitrary reasons, because he is that kind of man. <laughs> And we already know when the next operation will be, so I think it'll be fine. That's true. That's true. I don't know. Senpai, I'm begging you. <laughs> All right. I guess everyone needs a break now and then. Let's do it. Mitsuru, canon. Mitsuru likes to be begged to. <laughs> the beach, huh? Yes, yes! A special <laughs> I knew it! I was literally gonna say, this guy's gonna Hajime no Ippo this shit, and he's gonna be like, ah, oh, that's amazing. Yes, that'll bring natural resistance to my running. Perfect. I'll be able to get even stronger. Amazing. Oh man, I can't wait! Oh, I need to go buy a swimsuit. Hey, don't worry. I got one you can borrow. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Nice try. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. Are you going to spend Even Akihiko woke up from his protein stupor for I'm that one. I can't. I'll turn to dust if I'm exposed to sunlight. <laughs> Wait, seriously? Don't be well, stupid. Clearly, clearly, he's an immortal vampire. Chat, tell me, is is he is he 29 or 49? You can't tell the difference. You can't tell the difference. Vampire. Vampire. Actually, yes, actually his best joke. Yep. <laughs> Someone get a mirror. Stat, yes. Oh, oh. <gasps> Kirijo Senpai, wait up. Oh, oh, good, 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 good. I, I love this, I love this, yes. Uh, Come on. I just wanted to say sorry about the other day. Okay, I okay. might have gotten a little carried away. This is so good. Don't worry about it. In a way, it's only logical that we go to Yakushima. But the chairman said that no one who was responsible for the accident survived, but there is one who did. Yeah, of course. Of what? Course. Yeah. There is? My father. Okay. Keep going. I had no idea. No, keep going, keep going. Y'all should keep talking. Damn it! I feel like I have inserted far more of myself and my own ridiculousness into the headspace of this character. Because he's 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 such a like a I don't know. He's so flat. He feels like he could be way like super super depressed in general. But he just seems kind of flat. So like, I'm guessing what it is, is he's just lost so much, feeling is just a, a big deal. But hmm, what do you know? There was a survivor. And if there's one, then why won't there be two or three? Hmm, hmm. Now what's your thing? Hello. About Yakushima, remember that you won't be able to go if you don't score well on your exams. Ah, ah, oh no. Oh no! Since everyone is here, why don't you have the third years overlook your studies? Um. Well, yes. One second. Let me do one You're second. Really? Yeah. No. Oh, is that so? Well, there's no rush to make a decision right this moment. Let me know if you change your mind. I'll let everyone else know just in case. Uh. Akihiko! Akihiko, help me! I gotta say, I didn't expect Kitsuki san to come bearing good news. I figured he was just here to share more of his lame jokes. Yeah, yeah, um, okay, okay. Upstairs, upstairs, upstairs. <sighs> I'm so stoked for Yakushima, but that's one thing. You're as calm as ever, huh? I wish I had your chill. Bro, are we good? Are we good? Bro, is it just like that? Are we good? I think we're good. Uh. I apologize, but I'm not sure it really got across. It seems like there's this wall between us. Am I making any sense? I'm gonna go study now. Okay, okay, okay. There's literally a wall though. Like, you're on that side, she's on this side, you're on that side, she's on this side. Also, you can clearly tell, I mean, I'm not gonna say it, but um, you see how these are, you know, three very dorm-like spacings of doors here? And then Mitsuru's like, here! And then there's all that wall. <laughs> <laughs> Mitsuru, uh, your privilege is showing. Um, <clears throat> look at the map. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Mitsuru's like, ah, oh, I've suffered. My, it's, it's so hard being me. You don't understand. So let me walk these paces here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So she has a 50 foot, 50 foot long room. Okay, okay, now. One, two, three, four, five, and then about six. So 18 by 50. That is an 800 square foot room. I've lived in places smaller than that. Like with other people, like, like forget dorm, that's an apartment. I know that. Is. Okay, study. Goodbye. All right, I'll let the other second years know too. Hmm. With a ferry trip to Yakushima on the line. I hope you perform very well on your exams. If you I'm fine helping out with <sighs> we were studying. This close to greatness. Wouldn't it be easier to focus without the distraction? The whole squad. And then our pun bitch over there. But either way. Let's let's they go. They say studying Math. with others grants benefits that can't be found alone. Hmm. Yep. Hey, so wanna go fast, go alone. Wanna go far, friends. go together. Are we really gonna have to stay behind? Tell me that's a joke. It's no joke. As students, studying is our top priority. Failure will result in consequences. Well, I'm not too worried about that. Not naming names here, but don't get in the way, Junpei. <laughs> what happened to not naming names? Uh, I guess if the fate of my trip depends on it, I don't really have a choice. I'll show you got you. this, man. I'll prove just how serious I am about Yakushima. All right. My hand stops as I hit a tough question. What's the matter? Something you need help with? Um, oh shit. Um, which one of these will I more likely have a problem with? Probably not the grammar one. I remember something grammar related. It's probably gonna be vocabulary. Ah, scintillating. It can refer to either a literal spark or a metaphorical brilliance. That's easy. Learn your vocab. Or instead of going to Yakushima, you're going to Yakushimi back at the door. Uh, uh, Yakushima? <laughs> Yakushimi? <laughs> Maybe that one's a little forced. Okay, at least he's aware. Those cracks from Junpei are one thing. I didn't account for this. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he's trying to. Test our ability to concentrate? Ah. Uh, yeah, I suppose that's not likely. I haven't learned that skill for any of my personas yet. That's that's a really powerful skill. We don't have that yet. Hmm. Mikutsuki sounds one up in me. Yes, yes. I gotta think of a killer comeback. Yes. What have you got Stop even better? getting distracted. You need to concentrate on your studies. Oh, uh, yes, Mom. I mean... She's uh, right. Gotta focus. Mitsuru. Let's keep at it. I focused so hard, I couldn't hear anything else. All right. Yeah, that, there's no way that's hitting rank five anytime soon. Are you soon. struggling with memorization? Nothing beats repeating it until you know it by heart. Beats? Heart? <laughs> Not bad, Kirijo kun What? No, that that was not my intent with that statement. I will have you know I am well, above you're puns. Well, out of the race, then I win hands down. Kirijo Senpai defeated. What? What? Uh, this is giving me a headache. No, it's spreading. It's spreading. Despite the diversions, I'd say that was productive. Keep it up, so we can all go to Yakushima together. Such pun devastation. This was not my intention. First semester final exams begin today and will last for five days. All right, July's about to disappear. Here we go. This question seems familiar. Which form of magic is used to find water sources? Dowsing. Yes. It's dowsing. Yes. I'm feeling this is the right answer. Okay, there we go. Oh. One down. Here we go. Oh my god. This question seems familiar. How did the Witch of Agnesy gain the first half of its name? What? Damn it, no! Oh shit! I don't remember this one! 
Ah! Wait, 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 wait. Oh no, oh no. Okay, okay, okay. It's definitely not that a witch invented it. Wait, wait, actually, it might be. Oh no. Um, these two are too similar. The shape being bewitching and its enchanting formula, those are too similar. Oh, fuck, I forgot. It's, it's, I'm not looking at you, chat. I'm not looking at you, chat. It has to be one of these two. It has to be. This is my gut. My gut is telling me it's an error in translation. It has to be. All right, chat, help me out. Is it C? Yes! Yes! Ah! Oh, good! Okay! Sick! Yes! Oh! Okay! All right! I I still got it. Still got it. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. This question seems familiar. Who designed the prototype for the katana? Um... Uh, shoot, it was, um, it was Taira no Masakata. Masakato. It's not Prince Shotoku. It's not Hojo Tokimune. And this is just, <laughs> wait, wait. Is this even a real person? Because there's, I know someone named Yoshinobu, and Tokugawa is, there's Tokugawa Iyasu. But that feels like they just combined two very famous historical people from Japan's names together. And we're like, ha, this will catch their eye. I'm 99% sure it's Tyron the Masakado. These are all real people, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Okay, so I got it right. Nice, nice. All right, here we go. Whew. Okay. Tokawa Yoshinobu was a real person. Okay, gotcha. This question seems familiar. There's an error in this sentence. What kind is it? What? What? They're not showing me the sentence? Am I just supposed to remember what the thing was? Because I'm 99% sure it was a comma splice. But why not show me the sentence? The question is the sentence? Oh, oh wait, then it might not be a comma splice, hold on. Oh no, it is a comma splice. Cause it should say, there's an error in this sentence, period. What kind is it? Yeah, there's no misspelling. The apostrophe is correct. Missing subject, no. Yeah, it's a comma splice. Yeah, yeah, it has to be. Yeah, it's nice, cool. All right. How do we do? Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. Oh, okay. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. Wonderful, I wonderful. I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. Elizabeth said that a previously blocked path is now open. I should go check it out. On another stream, right chat? <laughs> Yo, yo, what's up? Thank God today's the last day of exams. Wait, what? It is? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We have one more? Oh, is this where they check my my score, my, my uh, academic score overall? Man, I can't wait to let off some steam. You gotta let loose during summer, you know? It's the last day of exams. Questions are just too easy. My pen won't stop moving. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Let's get it. I'm done, baby. Let's go. Who's the man? Jump face the man. Let's go. The days of testing are finally over. The sun is shining. Oh. So, how'd you do? You are not going to believe this. I ace PE. -E. <laughs> well, that pretty much answers my question. <laughs> Whatever. A real man doesn't dwell. <laughs> yeah, Already let's go. Ahead to the blue skies of Yakushima. Spoken like a true sports guy, you know? I, I don't even think about that. If you blunder in uh in, in a sport of some kind, short-term memory loss. You, you, once it's five seconds past whatever you just did where you fucked up, you don't think about it. You just keep on going, yep. Oh yeah, that's coming up soon, huh? Are you all ready to go? Uh, how about you? Me? Uh, not really. Oh, sorry, I don't sound very enthusiastic, do I? Hey, how about we stop somewhere on the way back? I don't have practice today. Yeah, let's just hang out. Come Sounds on. Good. Where we going? If yeah. you need to buy a swimsuit, I'd be happy to help. Very funny. All right, give me a sec. I'm gonna go grab my stuff from the locker room. Oh, 
I'll invite Fuka too. Yes, the group just hanging out, finally. Let's go. Hey, uh, I know I've been kind of a dick lately. Yeah, so, uh, what's up? Sorry about that. Yeah, don't worry about it, man. <laughs> All right, let's put this whole thing behind us. Cool? Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> what did I do yes. Now? Take it down a notch, will you? You bounce back from things so quickly, Junpei Kun. Yes, he does. You know it. Yep. Oh, hey, Sonata san's here. Don't see that every day. <laughs> Ikutsuki san called me. I think he wants to talk about a new candidate. Ah, here we go. Does that mean another person is going to join? Maybe. Maybe. Fuka. Oh, hey. What's wrong, Natsuki-chan? Yeah. Do you think you can stay after school with me for a mandatory study session? There's like no one. Oh, wait, are you about to head out for the day? Okay, then, never mind. Oh. Wait, it's all right. I'll help you. Sorry, I'll see you all back at the dorm later. Okay. Oh. I'm really surprised at how much she's changed. Yeah. Ah, friendship. Huh. How beautiful. No. Adolescence is such a wonderful thing. So full of vibrancy. <laughs> you, you. Oh. Oh. Oh, hello. I just stopped by to pick someone up. I'm going to introduce you to him now. The boy at the shrine. Yeah. Hello. Oh, Amadakun. What are you doing here? Yeah. You know him? He doesn't leave during the break because of his circumstances. Oh. Oh, I heard about that. Something about your parents, right? It used to only be me and my mom, but she got in an accident. So now it's just me. Damn. It happened two years ago. Right now, one of his distant relatives is paying for his school expenses. But that doesn't mean he should stay at the elementary school dorm all by himself, right? So yeah. I decided to move him to your dorm just for the summer. Okay. <laughs> to okay. our dorm? Do you really think that's a good idea? Why not? Why, of course. He has the potential. Then he's the new candidate? Mm. That's right. But as you can see, He's still just an elementary school student, so it's only a possibility for now. Hmm. Yeah, I like that Akihiko's you, not... Akihiko Sonata Senpai? Yeah, because... Okay, okay, so Akihiko feels right now like he's getting that big brother kind of energy here. And given that he has someone from, you know, his past that was older and involved in this whole thing, but got out of it, this feels very much like, do you want to be a warrior, little 11 year old? Yeah, yeah. You're gonna be a warrior and then we're gonna give you the armored Titan and then you're gonna go and you're gonna fight and you'll be for all, you know? Yep, yeah, it's, it's, it's gonna be amazing. Yeah, yeah, here kid, take this gun, you know? Like, ah, uh, okay. Uh, yeah. I've heard a lot about you. You've never lost a boxing match. Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah. Akiko, come on, talk it out. What is it? What is it? <laughs> oh, bye bye, school exams. Hello, summer vacation. Yakushima, here we come. I can't wait for Monday. Maybe I ought to hit up Polonia Mall to get some stuff for the trip. Oh. Yes, precisely. Oh, speaking of Polonia Mall. Here, take this. If you want to go ahead. Black sword, what? Mm, what's that? <laughs> it's just a small reward. You all deserve a little something after studying hard for exams. Have you heard of the antique shop at Polonia Mall? Oh, we're unlocking a new game mechanic. Okay, gotcha. Mayoido. Is that how you'd say that? Mayoido. Mayoido. Okay. That'd be correct. It just reopened today, actually. If you bring that to the shop, I'm sure they'll be of great help to you. Why? How's an antique shop gonna help us? Am I missing something? Hmm, 
My Yoido. Okay. Hmm, I can't quite explain it very well myself. It'd be better to hear from the shop owner than from me. Well then, I'll take. I'll let you take care of it from here. Okay. Cool. Let's go learn some stuff. That antique shop in Polonia Mall. The chairman suggested I pay them a visit. I'll head over there now. Oh, okay, here we go. Better get going. Oh, I can't even click on my my uh, my phone. My Yoido Antiques. How will they be able to help me? I don't know. I guess the only thing left to do is find out. Welcome. Whoa. Ah. Um. Welcome. Oh, are you in high school and you're shopping here? Well, take your time and look around. Seems that this lady owns the antique shop. I show her the black sword that I got from Ikutsuki. What? Hmm, what's that? Here, let me have a look. Hmm. I see. Ah, so you're one of the ones Kurosawa was talking about. This is but a humble antique shop. Having said that, I believe I can be of some assistance to you. <laughs> as long as they have something like this black sword, that is. This here is a base model for crafting weapons. By fusing it with various materials, you can craft special of equipment. Course. I can help you with the crafting process, but you'll have to collect the required materials yourself. These base materials can be found in places that tend to be quite unwelcoming. That's why it'll be up for you to collect them. By the way. Also, if you find any gems of the like, or the like, I'd be willing to exchange them for some of my wares here. Well then, go ahead and have a gander. You can travel to Fumayudo Antiques to conduct an item fusion or item exchange. Item fusions involve expending one weapon part and a handful of required materials to create a unique piece of equipment. In the item exchange, the proprietor will take any gemstones off your hands in exchange for items. Materials that are used in item fusions can be can often be found in Tartarus. You'll be able to collect them as you explore. More reasons to grind Tartarus, I guess. All right, uh, let's go hang out with Maya, though. Let's go online. Let's go boot up the laptop. Let's play MMOs, baby. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I see Maya. I went to the gym yesterday to work out. My muscles are sore, but I'm so buff. There's nothing a little endorphins won't cure, right? So much pain. Actually, I only went because I was so pissed at that bastard. Uh, well, uh, we know they're clearly talking about Tanaka, right? So I shouldn't ask what bastard. Say, you know, calm down. You're right, I should calm down. I should just calm down. <sighs> no, I just can't get it out of my mind. Oops. Maya seems upset. Remember that Mr. E guy? The SOB, right? I made a small error on some paperwork and now he's all on my ass. Oh, you're talking about somebody else. You're supposed to be teaching correct grammar, he told me. Shut the fuck up, old man. He thinks he's all that just because he's a classic lit teacher, for fuck's sake. Does he know who I am? I'm Maya, you old bastard. <sighs> if Mr. E starts playing this game too, I'm putting him on ignore. You can't talk to me either, okay? He honed. Maya's confiding in me. I feel like we're growing closer. That was probably one of the more, like, cringe interactions I've actually had with Maya, honestly. Mr. E probably doesn't have a computer at his house anyway. He probably uses an abacus. Talk about classic. Ugh. Much better. Maybe I'll go take a shower now. Don't worry. I won't let old geezer get me down, Tatsuya. Maya's player signed off. I decided to log out as well. I don't know, some of hers have been pretty funny, but I don't know. Ah, here they are. Hi. Kirijo Senpai and Sanada Senpai aren't here, so I, I'm thinking we can go to Tartarus tonight. Since we'll all be leaving for the trip tomorrow, I think I'll call it a day now. Oh, um, by the way, do you think Yukari-chan is doing all right? We went shopping for swimsuits this afternoon, but she looked pretty down the entire time. <sighs> hmm. It's not like I don't like Yakushima or anything. I usually love the ocean and getting some sun. I don't get seasick, so the trip's not an issue. <laughs> I just... I guess I'm just not really in the mood for it right now. Yeah, hmm. Okay. <laughs> Dude, I'm so ready for this. Look out, ladies, here I come. Yes, uh, but... Is that all you think about, Chimpei-kun? Jeez. You sure know how to leave your troubles behind. 
Wish I could let things go as easily as you do. There it is! There it is! Now she's honest! Yukari is always frustrated at Junpei because he finds happiness in the simplest of things. <laughs> and it makes her furious. She's like, how the fuck does this dumbass get so much joy out of the dumbest things? And he's like, which dumbass, you know? <laughs> You gotta live life to the fullest. And how are you gonna do that if you're always stuck moping? I know you're right, but still. Damn. Damn. Let's try this. Let me see what this URL leads to. Effective security measures online. This seems to be a website that helps with training security team members. There's a list of self-defense videos here, each with a detailed and text explanation. I decided to start with the most watched video. I watched a how-to video on how subduing violent individuals. I learned the importance of having the will to stand up to an enemy. Maybe I can use what I learned in our fights in Tartarus. You learned how to use ambush. You can now ambush enemies while exploring. When ambushing an enemy, you'll trigger chance encounters regardless of the direction the enemy is facing. Press and hold right trigger to dash for a set distance to enter the assault state. By pressing X on this state, you will ambush the enemy. Triggering an encounter from behind will slightly increase Shoto's theurgy gauge and may de-stress the enemy at the beginning of battle. Whoa! Holy shit, that's busted. It's gut lay shit back to my room. Yeah, that's that's really strong. I mean, because I'm never, like, I'm rarely, if ever, going to, uh, you know, not have that going, so. Dang. All right. Trip to Yakushima begins today and will last for four days and three nights. I need to get ready. Okay. Anime cutscene, let's go! Whoa! Looks like we're finally coming up on the island! Hell yeah! Ya! Ku! Shi! Ma! Jeez, you sound like a little kid. Aw, uh, he's just having fun. Personally, I'm ready for some training. <laughs> I do wonder what kind of flora and fauna live there. <laughs> Meanwhile, Mitsuru is distraught. Hmm. Interesting. Wow. Where are we? What? It's like we're in an episode of Lifestyles of the Rich and Fabulous. Ah. Welcome back, milady. Oh, my goodness. We won't be here long, but I'll be relying on you during our stay. You have maids? You... And you must be her associates from school, correct? Welcome to the Kirijo Vacation Home. Please, follow me. Here we go. Associates? Dude, real life maids. Br bro, calm down. It's I not like they're Rem and Ram or anything. Family, but this... Definitely proves it. Oh my god. <laughs> it's good to see you. Oh shit, this is dad? Wait, is this dad? What the hell? This guy is like... <laughs> Watch this guy just be like, I'm the butler. No, <laughs> like this guy is yoked out. You can just tell. But then also like the jawline. He's just like... Jesus. I heard the news. There isn't much here, but make yourselves comfortable. I... Uh, yes, sir. Isn't much here, too. There he goes. So, was that... Her father? Yep. He was so intense. <laughs> What's up with them wearing a suit in this kind of heat? Always wears a What's suit. What's wrong with that? We won't be here long, but make yourself at home. Sweet! This is gonna rock! Hey, wanna go to the beach? It's literally right there! Oh man! I'm so ready for this! Come on, let's go! Alright. What? We just got here. I mean, it's gonna take time to get changed and stuff. Then, I'll see you there. I'm yeah. not gonna waste a single minute. Alright. Go Junpei! 
All right. Ah, sandals on, giving my feet a chance to breathe. Akihiko is a Akihiko is a speedo, bro. Let's go. <laughs> and he's just wearing the the shirt because you know I don't need to show off everything. Like, damn. Yep, summer's here. Darn. There's nothing out there I can use as a marker. Too bad. I was hoping for a good swim. Dude, just run the the, the perimeter uh, of the island. What's with that swimsuit? What do you mean? It gives me no resistance. Dude, yeah. swim briefs? Nobody wants to see your junk. <laughs> but they're better for swimming. Yeah. You gotta be kidding. We come all the way to the beach, and you're gonna train? What's wrong with that? You got a better idea? Hang out? Spend time together? Damn right I do! It's summertime at the beach! I've got the perfect activity. Ah, yes. Do tell. Wow. It's beautiful. Oh, hey! They're here. Oh my gosh, of course. <laughs> hey! <laughs> What are you looking at? Say hello to contestant number one, Yukari Takeba. That's quite a bold design. She's really strutting her stuff. Archery practice must do wonders for the self-esteem. Mm. Huh? If no one seems to have claimed the umbrellas around here, do you think we can go ahead and use them? Ooh, next up is contestant number two, Fuka Yamagishi. Wow, Fuka, do you wear swimsuits often or? Oh, whoops, was it something I said? <laughs> Didn't mean to embarrass you. <laughs> hey, oh my god. Hey, cut it out with that laugh, you creep. And for our final contestant of the day. Oh my gosh. What happened? Is something wrong? Wow. No contest. Right. Yeah. You're so beautiful. No. No contest. Like like I mean it's just, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, your skin is totally flawless. Hey, did you put on sunscreen already? She is her. I mean, that's no, true. Not yet. Well, we can't have that. You gotta put some on right now. Oh, can I? Help? That's true. You should. Yeah. Well, that's okay. Be safe. I'll do it myself. No. No, dude. Dude. <laughs> so, which one's your type? Oh no! Oh no! I don't have a social link with any of them yet. Oh man! I mm, I will say I will say I don't care. Yeah. I believe that. <laughs> Jim Bay's like, yeah, you're full of great. shit. <laughs> Damn it! He saw through like. <laughs> All right, I think it's about time for a swim. Well done, Jimpei, you the man. Oh, I'm not letting you win yep. that easily. Yep. Huh? Wait. What was that? What? Hold on. I feel uneasy. What? What's going on? It's like someone is watching me. What? Oh shit. <laughs> it's cold! <laughs> The uneasy feeling went away. What are you standing over there for? The water's fine. What? We must investigate. You, you, you're not sitting in the shade, Mitsuru. There's a. The shade is over here. Well, they even lined it up with the sun. That's that's cool of them. So who? Oh oh. What's going on here? The white sand on the beach is so fine it feels nice underneath my feet. Come to think of it, Elizabeth asked me to get her something that feels like the ocean. Ah, Elizabeth might be happy if I gave her a pretty seashell from the beach. Nice, okay. Very cool, okay. Hmm, okay. Akiko, my man, what are you up to? I'm glad everyone's having fun out there. Voice acting, let's go. Our operations during the dark hour are taxing on let's both go. mind and body. 
You should relax a little. Rest up. Aww. If you need to take a break, the best spot to kick back is underneath the parasol. Bro, Mitsuru's right over there. Like, she's right over there. Bro. Bro. She's, 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 like, nobody else. Bro. 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 You know what? You're hopeless. And if she chooses me instead of you, and you're speedo wearing ass, that's your fault. You're a dumbass. And I love you, but that's on you. Okay. Wonder if this driftwood washed ashore from a distant place. Come to think of it, Elizabeth asked me to get her something that feels like the ocean. Ah, I will get you driftwood as well. Hmm, yes. Daki wearing SOS. <gasps> Akihiko, well done. Well done. As we can see here, Akihiko is a very wonderful uh, member of this community and is sporting some very lovely, never before seen merchandise uh, from uh, this channel, uh, clearly, clearly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's a lovely place, wouldn't you agree? Y yes, When lovely. I was younger, I used to come here fairly often, but I haven't had the chance to visit since starting high school. Help us, please! That's not so good, help us, please! You think it won't stop? <laughs> He's splashing them! Come on! <laughs> Water fights are pretty much a given at the beach. Nice and cool, ain't it? Hey, knock it off! You're taking this too far! <sighs> okay, fine. You asked for it. Get him, yeah, get him! Why can't I... Oh, there we go. Here we are on summer vacation, but I <sighs> still have to deal with Junpei's usual antics. Woohoo! Thanks, Kirito-senpai. Right now, I feel like I could die with no regrets. Aww, good stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad everyone's having a good time. This is awesome. Ooh, another thing. Watching the waves roll into the shore is somewhat calming. Ah, yes, some seaweed swirling in the waters at my feet. I get some strange seaweed. Oh, what's this? The waves that lap on the shore are sparkling and shimmering. Another thing, we get a tiny crab for Elizabeth. We're gonna give Elizabeth so much shit. She's just gonna be like, oh, uh, 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 th thank you. Uh, so, okay, do we just leave? Is that it? Dude, Joe, man. Hey. Oh, dude, where are you going? They never say play alone. They say never play alone at the beach. But, but, all right, then I guess we're going this way then. Mm. Leaving already? Yeah. <sighs> That's lame. Well, I'm gonna stay a little longer. See you later then. Even the food was fancier than I could have imagined. Ah, oh, you should have I've shown never the had food. To think about the proper way to use a fork and knife so much. Ugh. I can't eat anymore. Not even another bite of caviar. No one said you had to try to eat all of it. Well, I'm sure we're all exhausted from the trip. Why don't you go rest up in your rooms? Yeah, you too. Oh, are you not coming with us, Senpai? Yes, I'll join you in just a minute. Hmm. It's been a while. Here we go. <laughs> just, hmm. I'm glad that you're in good health. Our guests are residents of the dorm, I presume. I'm sorry for bringing such a crowd. I heard you told them about the incident. Why did you hide it for so long? Oh. I wasn't hiding it. Interesting. I've told you time and again, none of the blame is yours. Whoa. But. Two in harmony surpasses one in perfection. That has been our guiding principle since the Kirijo family separated from the Nanjo group. Oh shit, okay, okay. Green text, thank you game, thank you. Interesting. Hmm. <sighs> you must learn to trust in others, Mitsuru. There are things in this what? world that cannot be accomplished alone, no matter how many sacrifices you make. I understand. Damn, actually you like- You accessed our database, didn't you? Actually, like... That brings me to my next question. Huh. Why don't you ask me directly, instead of using this trip as an excuse? I... I'm sorry. 
Bring them here, all of them. Whoa. I have no intention of concealing the truth from them. Whoa. I've made preparations to disclose everything. Everything. There's a girl named Takiba in your group, correct? Oh, Rather here we go. To her power. It must be fate. Father? What the hell? From what I understand, Mitsuru has already given you the short version. This is amazing! I, I thought this was gonna be some asshole, and it's gonna be, you know, difficult for no reason other than I am rich dad, and I thus must be an asshole. But actually, what the hell? He's amazing. But, you know, oh, yes. see where we're going with this, though. Well, it's true. We adults are to blame. <laughs> if I could have atoned for it with my life. I would have done so. Holy shit! Can I hear that again in a Persona game? Well, it's true. We adults are to blame. Go home. This is the best Persona game ever. <laughs> now I have no choice but to rely on you. What my father wanted to create with those monsters' power. It was a time manipulation device. <laughs> okay, what? Wait, I thought it was gonna be like, yeah, we were gonna harness the the shadows in order to understand the nature of the difference between shadows and personas. And thus we were going to build a, 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 you know, a, a world, a, a, a group of people that would all have personas or, or some shit. And they would be able to do, no, we went straight to time manipulation. Oh, 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 we are, we are, we are jumping all the way over the shark and the moon and the everything. Okay. That's what he was trying to do? <laughs> Imagine if you could control the flow of time. Eliminate unwanted events before they occur. Right. With such a device, you could shape the future to your and liking. And we only got the dark hour out of this. Yeah. That's insane. Unfortunately, under my father's direction, the research began to stray from its original goal. Okay. In his later years, my father seemed to have only nihilism in his heart. In fact, his madness may have resulted from his struggle to break free from that. Oh. It's only natural that you want to know the truth. And it's my duty to tell you. Tartarus, yeah. In the dark hour. What's this? This is the only existing footage of the accident, recorded by a scientist who was at the scene. A video recording? Let's see it. Let's see it. I can only hope that this recording reaches someone with a conscience. Uh, oh, her Wait dad. Yeah. My employer has become obsessed oh, with a loathsome shit. idea. Oh, shit. This experiment should never have been conceived. Yeah. I'm afraid the damage will be staggering. At this point, it's unavoidable. But I didn't have a choice. If I didn't do this, it could have destroyed the entire world. Wow. Destroyed the entire world whoever is watching this please i need you to listen to me very carefully the shadows that were amassed here have been dispersed as a result of the explosion in order to end this you have no choice but to eliminate all of them i am the one responsible for this i knew the risks but i was blinded by the promise of success and so i chose to continue without objections mm. i am responsible Shit. Huh? So the s uh, okay, okay. So so the explosion was basically to stop things from going all the way. And if that didn't happen, things would have been absolutely just bad, horrible. Yeah, dad pressed the boom button, which is, you know, hilarious that it you know, it was so total that also her dad killed, you know, tons of people. You know, no big deal. Her dad's not only dead, but also her dad killed every scientist. <laughs> every scientist. I will say this is maybe this is maybe the other thing that's a little bit like weird, but um there was very clearly some kind of like cut static in the video. It really felt like either they're going for the 
footage was damaged kind of thing, but that's not really how um, digital video works. So it feels more like it was edited. So I don't trust this video in its entirety. Yeah, we're in 2009. We're not in, you know, 1999. So my, my main thing I have with this is that what it might be is that this guy's being so forthcoming as like a, this is our very handy scapegoat thing that we're giving to all you guys so that you guys don't investigate more into our group. And that's why the dad is seeming so like, oh, that was in 1999? Oh, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> that's right, this was 10 years ago from the game time. Oh, right. <laughs> it literally was 1999. <laughs> Okay, so then maybe, maybe, maybe it was, but um, yeah, it just feels too convenient in general. Yeah, they did say they shifted the blame to one scientist. Yeah, yeah. So, but yeah, it's very convenient to say that the footage was probably sent out from the, you know, the, the place. And then rather than wait, I guess, for some help or something, he still goes through with it and ends up dying in the process. But who knows, maybe it was so bad in the situation that they were doing here. Like it would have unwound the fabric of time or something like that. It would have, it would have, yeah, I don't know. I feel like just the fact that they're going in for the idea that the Tartarus part of the Dark Hour wasn't necessarily an accident, but it is just a minor version of what the intended effect was is kind of a thing for me because I thought they were just going to have it be that Tartarus was the was the side effect. That was just the oh shit, now we have Tartarus in the dark hour. Could have been edited recently. Yeah, yeah. I think I think that's still a possibility. Dad? All right. You mean that was <gasps> Yeah. Father. His name was Aichiro Takiba. He was the head researcher at the time and a very talented man. But we are the ones who are responsible. Hmm. We pushed him to continue the research. The Kirijo group is to blame for his death. Okay, no, he's he's a good guy. Uh, are yeah. you... So that means my dad caused it all. The Dark Hour, Tartarus, the people who died. It was all his fault. No. <sighs> Yeah, no, no, no. So is that why you were hiding this? Because you felt sorry for me? Is that it? No, talk about I... No. Uh, oh, shit. I don't want your pity! Talk about... Oh, this is, this is gonna be spicy. Um, shouldn't someone go after her? I don't have the courage for that, sorry. Espresso. Will you go? Uh, yeah, my charm, my courage, my academics, it's, it's too low. Sure, yeah. Thank you. Now nah, let's send Jim back. <laughs> oh, damn. I believed in him for so long. Okay. This is too much. Espresso <sighs> can... Remember what I told you at the hospital? How Vaguely. my dad died yeah. when I was little. You understand now, right? Mm -hmm. He died in that incident. Yeah. Nobody knew the truth, so there were all sorts of rumors. Because he was in charge of the research team, people were really mean to me and my mom. Oh. We even had to move a few times. I see. That must have been tough. Yeah. But all this time, I kept telling myself it mm. wasn't his fault. I loved him a lot. And I believed he'd never do anything wrong. I received a letter back in spring. It was yeah. from him, written ten years ago. It cracked me up, because even though he said to my family, it was more or less all about me. Oh. And that only made me believe in him more. When I found out I had a special power, I thought it was fate. I was scared, but I thought if I cooperated with the Kirijo group, I might find It all out ties what really together. Happened. Perfect. That's why I agreed to fight using my persona. But now, 
Now I can see it was all for nothing. It's not true. Yeah, come on. You're just trying to make me feel better. <laughs> Reality sure is harsh, huh? I tried Aww. so hard to fight my fear. And this is what I get. Yeah. And you know, I think maybe I was jealous, too. Sure. I mean, after all that's happened. Why does Kirijo Senpai's father get to live? Yeah. I'm a horrible person, aren't I? Oh. No, not at all. Wow. I don't know how you do it. You're always so calm. Nothing ever phases you. Did you really think I could just be cheered up so easily? Oh. You think you know me? Oh. You don't know anything. This is too real. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. I can barely make sense of all of this. I'm so mm -hmm. afraid. I just feel so lost now. Just tell me. What am I supposed to do now? I don't know. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, man. Damn, I like all these options. Persona 3 giving us three really good options here. I'm kind of a it's okay not to know kind of person. Like, that's me. I think that Stay With Us and Fight has this little bit of like, yeah, like, yeah, you know? Don't lose hope is a negative, you know? She's asking what is she supposed to do, and we're telling her, well, not to do. So I don't really like one as much. It's okay not to know. Yeah. Huh? You really are something else. Sorry for acting like this. I know you've lost your parents too. Yep. I'll be all right. I'm used to dealing with stressful situations. Anyway, hmm. thanks for listening. <laughs> Let me guess. Senpai asked you to bring me back, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought so, but still, thanks. Yeah. Kari's laughing, though her eyes are all red from all the crying. Oh, I'm not gonna have the courage for this though, so we're still gonna try it though. Hey! Yeesh, what's taking you guys so long? Hey! Everybody was getting worried. It's almost the dark hour, so we gotta head back. All right. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, did I miss something? <laughs> no, I I just almost forgot. It doesn't matter where you are when the dark hour comes. Oh well, come on, that's common sense. Even I remembered that. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I've been thinking lately. Once you awaken to the power of persona, you remember everything that happens during the dark hour. Mm -hmm. In exchange for power, you can no longer look away from the things you don't want to see. Mm -hmm. We can't escape reality, can we? Nope. That's a good insight. I guess we've just got to stay strong, huh? Yeah, guess so. All right, then. Let's head on back. I get the vibe again. What's going on? It feels like I'm being watched again. What the hell? Decided to head back anyway. It's day two of our vacation in Yakushima. <sighs> the air is so fresh. In the woods could be so enjoyable. You can't do this in Iwatodai. Mm. <sighs> oh. Help them, Fuka! Help them! Help them bond! Yes, yes! Oh, uh, did you hear about Junpei kun yesterday? He was acting so indecent, I didn't know how to react. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably a good thing we came out here by ourselves. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh. 
Mitsuru speaking. One moment. Let me switch over to speakerphone. Go nice. ahead. Well, I'm at the lab here on the island, and a machine that was considered inoperable suddenly left the facility on its own. Oh, uh, what? A machine? What kind of machine is it? I need more information to locate anything other than shadows. It's a type of combat vehicle. An anti-shadow weapon, to be precise. A combat vehicle? You mean like a tank? Wait, we gotta what? tell the others. Where's my phone? We're not currently with everyone, so it might take some time for us to regroup. All right. I see. In any case, I want you to handle this as soon as you can. I'm on my way there now. If we can't secure the target, do we have permission to destroy it? I highly doubt you will be able to destroy it. Oh, shit. What? Then how are we supposed to stop it? Yeah. Just do your best. I'll call you again later. Okay. Great. No one's answering. Don't worry about it. Let's go back and get our equipment. Okay. Once we do that, we can have Yamagishi's persona scan the area. Although searching the whole island won't be easy. Ugh, the one time we need them and they're nowhere to be found. <sighs> and Foka just wanted you two to bond. Huh? Are the girls not up yet? Man, those sleepyheads. The ocean's not gonna sit around and wait for us, you know? Once the sun sets, the water temperature drops, tiring you out much faster. Huh? Uh, I guess. <laughs> That's really what you're worried about? <laughs> Junpei, that reminds me. Didn't one of the maids give you something as we were leaving? <laughs> you saw that, huh? One of Wait, the maids what? gave me a letter. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh my Maybe god. It's a of love. Well, it sure is tough being this popular. <laughs> you're a moron. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here it says we've gone to see the Jomon Cedar Tree. Huh? This looks like Yamagishi's handwriting. Yeah. Oh man, we're at an island resort in the middle of summer. Why are they going to the beach? That's just not right. <laughs> well, it is your fault. Okay. What do you mean? I just wanted to lighten the mood yesterday. I don't want to hear it. Oh. Well, it doesn't matter now. Dad anyway. is disappointed in you. On our own. Just a guy. This is the frontier of romance. We're bound to meet someone new out here. We'll call this Operation Yakushima Beach Fling. Ah. Oi, Wait, You mean we're gonna pick up girls? How about it, Sonata san? With you on the squad, we're guaranteed to succeed. Uh, I mean, what is this we oh, situation? Your plan. What do you think about this? Let's begin the operation. <laughs> then I'm appointing him our leader, as usual. As usual. What? Why? You said it yourself. This is an operation. Bullshit! You better take this seriously. It's an important operation. Important operation. Akihiko, you know, if you think about it, lifting is kind of like picking up. So, you know, oh my god, the music is. <laughs> the music! Oh my god, it took me a second! <laughs> Okay, that's amazing. First things first, we'll assess the competition. The man is sweaty. Are you here to pick up chicks? You're doing it wrong. You have to be more subtle or it'll put them off. I'm here today with the intention of getting a girlfriend too. It makes us rivals, doesn't it? Yeah. Did you see these boys? You have to deal with them and me. Numbers, rules, baby. So back off. Oh, what's going on over here? All right, we're gonna head back first and start prepping for the barbecue. 
Okay, thanks for walking us here. We'll join you after we take some photos. Ah, oh, shit. It's a pretty tough competition here. Hello there, pretty lady. Forest bathing is great and all, but I hate that it gets my feet dirty with mud. I can't relax on the beach like this. I think I'll take a quick shower first. Ah, I love that the objective says commence the operation. I'm going to collect pretty seashells and make a necklace. Wonderful. You do that. I heard there was a beach where kids can play. I was nervous at first, but I decided to move here. Now when I see them playing so happily, it makes me glad we came. Wonderful, wonderful. All right. Here we go. Ooh, target set. Let's move in for the kill. Okay, this is my area of expertise, so let me give you some pointers. Yes, yes, clearly. First off, think of something to talk about, something they might be interested in. Give them an easy question and get the ball rolling. That's the golden rule. All right. Something like, where are you from? Or, having fun. Having fun. Once you get fun. started, you'll be going back and forth like you're playing catch. I'll start things off, then you ask the questions. Right? Oh my god, yes, please let me ask the questions. Okay, here we go. Hey there, ladies. Having fun? None of your business. <laughs> No need to be shy. Destruction 100. Why should we tell you anything? Why? Uh, well. Come on, we're just making conversation. How is this like playing catch? Don't worry, I got this. Watch and learn. So, ladies, are you in college? Or maybe you're already working? Um. You guys seem a little young. Are you still in high school? Ah! Uh, <laughs> yep, that's right. Yep, absolutely. I'm a dad. Yeah, yeah. Yep, that's right. High school kids vacationing in Yakushima? That kind of pisses me off. <laughs> Sorry you feel that way. We're only here because we were invited to our friend's vacation home. Wow. A vacation home in Yakushima? Good for your friend. <laughs> yeah. On the other hand, had to save up our own money to come here. Oh, that's a pretty big accomplishment, huh? <laughs> no, not really. So what do you guys want, anyway? We came to hit on you! Ah! <laughs> I just love the idea that <laughs> Shoto has just gone full robot. I asked the question, Junpei didn't say what to do after that. So they asked me a question, I answered honestly. And then he's like, what What did you came here to do? Yep, we came to hit on you. That's what we came to do. Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> I like your honesty. Mm. Don't encourage them. They'll go away if we ignore them. Wait, 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 don't do that. How can you blame us for wanting to talk to such beauties? <sighs> These guys are full of shit. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> See you later. Yeah, just... <laughs> he would say it, just... Yes. See you later. Yeah, you were playing catch, all right. Right, right. Hey, I did my best. And what about you, Sonata-san? If that's how you feel, then show us how it's done. Why do I have to show you anything? Yeah. Well, you said this was an operation, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Aren't we supposed to work together in order to succeed? <sighs> Clearly, these ones were resistant to everything, so now it's your turn to initiate combat. You know, baton pass. Your turn, Akihiko. I guess you've got a point. <laughs> Fine, I'll give it a shot. I'm sure I'll do better than you at least. It's mental focus training, Can you give me a hand? Go. I'll go ahead and set the pace. Alright. Let's go. Come on, it's time to go home. Daddy's waiting for us. What's for dinner today? The fish daddy caught? Yes, dad catches all the fish. Those girls are kind of harsh. You shouldn't argue with them when they're like that. Just agree with them with what they say and shower them with compliments. That's a very basic technique. 
Sure, sure, bro. I rented the car because I heard you could drive along the coast, but you can't really see the ocean from the road because my glasses are very opaque. Well, it's fine because my girlfriend had fun anyway. Yeah. Guys who can drive are so cool. I ended up watching them instead of the scenery outside. Wait, are you hitting on me? Sorry, but I'm here with my boyfriend. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, spotted a new set of targets. Oh my gosh. Hmm. What are you waiting for, Sonata-san? Show us what you got. Just keep your mouth shut. Yeah. Hey, Nobuko. Are those boys looking at us? Oh, yeah, they are. Wow, Yoshie. I'm surprised you could see from over there. Huh? All right. Time to get in the ring. Uh, uh, hi there. S uh, sorry to bother you. But, uh, I, I wanted to ask you something. And what would that be? Uh, um, are you, uh, two here alone? <laughs> <laughs> are you hitting on us? <gasps> no, no, not, not at all. <laughs> we just thought that if you're bored... Uh, He's so awkward! Awkward. Uh, uh, a chance meeting like this might stir things up for both of us, uh, you know. <laughs> he, he's so, he's so awkward. What, what is this? This guy is, this guy is such a magnet for, like he's, <laughs> he has so many people falling all over him and he's just like, ah, yes, I think we could have things stir, you know. Like, like food, if we let it simmer, you know, all the fat will burn off and what will be left with will be the succulent protein, you know, meaty goodness and, you know, yeah. <laughs> and isn't that what it means to hit on someone? <laughs> Haven't you heard? It's lame to hit on girls at the beach nowadays. Ooh. Aw, come on. We were bored anyway. And besides, they look kind of cool. <sighs> really, Nobuko? <laughs> hey, how old do we look to you? Oh no, wait. Wait. Oh, oh no, wait, 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 sus, sus. Um, uh oh. Uh, around 20? <laughs> Seriously? We still look that young? Aw, I'm so happy to hear that, even if it's just flattery. To tell you the truth, we're actually older than that. Well, yeah. Uh oh, you are? That, that's too bad. <laughs> Why do you no, say it's too that's bad? That's fine by us. Older women are more mature and experienced and stuff. You know, you're a pretty smooth talker for someone so young. Oh, no. Oh, no. Anyway. Truth is... Where in high school? I'll be graduating next year. Oh gosh, that's more of an age gap than I was expecting. See, it's not gonna work out. Besides, I doubt you're having any fun talking to us. Right, it's boring. <laughs> yes, again, Shoto is just like, I answer honestly. Yes, that's true. I'm listening to what that one guy over there said. I agree. I agree. Yes. I complimented you. I said you were around 20. And now I'm agreeing with everything you say. Yes. It's boring. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> wow. He called us boring. <laughs> what do you mean, Yoshie? He was just kidding. Nobuko, you need to stop being so nice to everyone. Oh, come on. It's been ages since I've done this. Ages? Tease these kids enough. We should head back. They're gonna be waiting on us, you know. They? You mean, you have boyfriends? Oh, right. Sorry, forgot to mention that. Well, we gotta go now. We're meeting our boyfriends back at the villa for a barbecue. You can come if you want. Bye. 
Sonata son. <laughs> what happened? He looked like a bunch of idiots. <laughs> Akiko is so uncomfortable right now. <laughs> you haven't been pulling your weight either. Alright. Gotta come through on the next one. You hear me? Okay. It's my turn now. Yeah, I can't believe that Akihiko turned down free food. But why? Oh, I, I don't remember the last time I lost it something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks like Sonata-san's mojo, Sonata mojo was a no-go outside of school. His mojo's a no-go. Oh, I like that. That's, that's good. Looks like she already has a boyfriend. Tough luck. Uh, it's lame to hit on girls at the beach, they said. All right. How about here? There's a woman over there all alone. Hmm. All alone, though, at the beach. She's probably not got a great personality, then. Not have any friends to come to the beach with. That's either sad and depressing, or that's like, ugh, yikes. It's unusual to find someone. Yeah, I was gonna say that. Yeah, yeah. No yeah. boyfriends to be seen hmm. in the area, either. I think we're in the clear. All right. Time to make contact. Excuse me, miss. Oh, hello. Can I help you? Oh, she's hot. <laughs> Say, uh, you here alone? Yeah, and I'm so bored. I've been watching you, by the way. Oh. You've been trying to pick up girls for a while. Well, how'd you do? It was an utter failure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's what I thought. You boys don't understand women at all. Guess I can't deny that. You in the hat. You're way too wrapped up in yourself. Oh, Shouldn't advice. you be thinking more about how to make your partner happy? Hmm. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> you in the t-shirt. You're the type that's stoic, but not very experienced with girls. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that might be true. Here we go. You seem like kind of a hassle, too. Like you're super logical about everything. Oh, oh. And you, <laughs> with the long hair. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not sure about you. Hey, don't hold back. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're mysterious. Like, no one can ever tell what you're really thinking. Hmm. You know what I mean? I do, yeah, actually. Oh, you're so smart. Mm-hmm. I think you're just my type. Oh, shit. Hey, wait a second. Just joking. I like you a lot, too. Really? Oh. Want me to tell you what would make me really happy? Oh, no. I'm starting to see a, a massive health bar starting to come across the, uh, the screen here. I, I can I can feel some kind of Could I ask you to help me put on my sunscreen? Uh oh, uh oh. What? Uh oh. Uh, you're alright with that? Of course I am. I have enough for you too. I mean oh. <laughs> the noise! I'm really sorry guys, but I'm not passing up this chance. <laughs> oh my Would gosh. Would you like to join too? I'll give you a good deal. A deal? What? You know that sun in the sky isn't real, right? That's an artificial sun that got sent into space back in the 1980s. <laughs> huh? Wait! You what? didn't know? What? Turns out that sun sent out harmful <laughs> rays that mess with your body's equilibrium. <laughs> Normal sunscreen doesn't work. But that's where this special one comes in. And if you opt in right <laughs> now, you get three bottles for just 300,000 yen. Hey, doesn't she sound kind of strange? <laughs> Wait, of all the things, of all the things I thought was gonna happen, I thought it was gonna be something more like, oh, like, like, we're in for a situation where she's gonna be, you know, too aggressive, and then we're gonna be like, uh, no, 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 we're gonna, we're gonna pull back, you know, please check her name in the logs. Delusional lady, she she switched from pretty lady to to delusional lady. Uh, yeah, retreat, retreat. <laughs> Sorry to bother you. Aw, <laughs> you're so cruel. <laughs> uh, 
this sucks so much. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. What's wrong with you? I thought you weren't interested in picking up chicks. If I'm in a match, I won't <sighs> win. <sighs> I know what our problem is. You can't control yourself. Don't. What? Don't blame this on me. I mean, it's kind of true, but you know. I'm just stating the obvious. Not like you scored either, Sonata-san. Why you always gotta be so logical? Even in front of babes, it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> what did you just say? Oh. Junpei and Sonata continue to bicker. That's it. Leader, whose fault do you think it is? Uh, well, I clearly it's both your fault. I won't accept a stalemate. Oh! It's either him or me. <laughs> yeah, that answer ain't gonna cut. Besides, what the hell do you know? What? <laughs> what? What? Do you see something? Oh shit. Wait. Oh shit. <laughs> A combat vehicle? <gasps> oh shit. Talk about saving the best for last. Now that's what I'm talking about. Holy hell, she's cute. Yeah. She is. <laughs> oh man, this is insane! If we nail this, it'll blow our failures out of the water! How about this time, we try going one by one instead of all together? Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm in. Cool, cool. Clearly. Okay, and let's decide the order. We'll go clockwise, starting with the winner. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors! Oh, um, uh, uh, we're an anime protagonist, we always throw rock. I lost. God damn it. Oh, uh, yeah. I win. Damn it. Okay, I'll go first. Sonata not a second, and you'll go last. Shit. Here goes. Uh, hey. I notice you've been, uh, staring at the ocean. So, um, you here with anyone? My name's Jujunpei. <laughs> Jujunpei? Jujunpei. <clears throat> um, I was just wondering if you'd be down to talk. If you're done, is it? I mean, it's more fun than standing here all by yourself, right? I am looking for someone. Uh, oh yeah? Oh? You are not that someone. Yeah, definitely. Definitely a robot, yeah. Wow, you got shot down faster than I expected. <laughs> She's a tough one, Senpai. <laughs> Jujinpei Kaisen, yes, well done. Amazing. Oh, hey, do you like the uh, motion? <laughs> the Is your question motion. directed at me? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I like the ocean. I, uh, you know, I heard something interesting about triathletes who train at indoor pools. Apparently, they get outperformed by athletes who train in the ocean. That information is irrelevant to me. <laughs> irrelevant! Akihiko is irrelevant! Oh! <laughs> well, I won. I talked to her longer than you did. <laughs> it doesn't matter how long you talk to her! My turn. <sighs> this sucks. I could cry. Okay, you cry. Hey, don't cry. You cried to Akihiko's me feel bad. very necessary t-shirt. Well, that's where we are. If you can't pull this off, I'm gonna be traumatized for the rest of my life. Well, here we go. We're on the ropes, but it's not over yet. It's all up to you now. Mm -hmm. I'll avenge you. <laughs> All right. 
What should I say to her? <sighs> the tide is high. <laughs> hey, baby. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Hey, baby, but in the Zeppeli voice? Oh, my God. Hey, baby. <laughs> Tide is high is totally at the P3 project with Flirt. It's amazing. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do the Tide is high, yeah. Tide is high. You. Oh. I can hear what he said, but she looks surprised. We should go over there. No. <laughs> Initiating evasive maneuver. Confirmation must be made at a secure location. Yeah, here we go. Why did she know her toe runs out? <laughs> yeah! Hey, what did you say to make her run away like that? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, cute boy! E evasive maneuvers! Cast Sukukaja! <laughs> Just <laughs> fucking dips! <laughs> yeah! Please be in the party, please be best girl, and please be. I don't know. Star Arcana, probably. That that would be my that would be my guess if uh, they have a social link. Well, what are you That'd be my guess. For? Go after her. <sighs> yeah, you're right. This could turn into serious trouble. You gotta go tell her you're sorry. If you don't, we'll get all the blame. Yeah. Go on and catch her if you hurry. Hmm. I decided to follow the girl into the forest. Yeah. All right. Come on. Come on, go after her. Get on your knees, beg for forgiveness, and introduce her to me. <laughs> the way she just started off is odd. Uh -huh. now, I'm not sure what you said to her, but you better clear up the misunderstanding. Clearly. We go, we go. <laughs> she <laughs> And the way she was clipping on the wall. <laughs> on the invisible wall of the pen. <laughs> I should go after and clear up the misunderstanding. <laughs> this is so good. This is so good. I'm finding this way funnier probably than it needs to be. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah. Nyom. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Please show it to me again. Yes. <laughs> I love it! It's so good! Yes, I should go after her. I I don't know why. I just find this so funny. This is so damn funny. Yes, such speed. Uh such incredible tenacity. Wow. Ah! <laughs> she uses stealth. It's super effective. I lost sight of the girl. No! Really? <laughs> She's even doing the chopper! She's basically doing the chopper hide thing. Like, she like stands out of frame and then leans in and is like, I don't move. It's the girl from earlier. She must be the one who's been watching me. Oh, okay. I'll wait patiently. Now I am certain. Oh. I have found you. Okay. I have been searching for you. My highest priority is to be at your side. Oh. What? <laughs> and they come in right at the right what? time. What? Are you freaking kidding me? What's going on? He didn't even say anything to her. Ah, yes. It seems like she still doesn't want to let me go. There you guys are. <laughs> what are you doing here? We've been looking all over for you. Yukari, turn a little bit to the um, right. What are you doing in How the middle of the woods in your swimsuit? How are they ignoring her? You have no idea what we've... Huh? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Who's this? And why is she hugging you? After you just hugged me? Listen, we have a slight situation here. Ah, yes. I'm sorry to interrupt your vacation, but I need everyone to go back to the house and gear up. Oh, damn. Ah, that won't be necessary. We found what we were looking for. Okay. Mr. Chairman, what do you mean? 
<laughs> you had me worried. Ah. You can't just leave the lab on your own, I guess. I guess. Understood. Interesting name choice, actually. Sorry for all the trouble. Everything is under control now. Hmm. Hmm. What happened to securing the tank? Oh, that's been taken care of. That 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 was the I tank. Join us over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Understood. Affirmative. Oh my goodness. This is I guess. As you can see, she's a machine with the form and face of a human girl. I am I guess. My objective is to exterminate Shadow. <sighs> I have been assigned to seize. Effective immediately. Wow. Okay. No way. It's like she's alive. This is unbelievable. How can a robot be <sighs> this cute? What a cruel world. Yes, yes indeed. Ten years ago, a plan was enacted to create anti-shadow weapons. A contingency in the event a shadow became unmanageable. Mm. I guess was the last one to be made. And she's the only one that still remains today. Oh my god, this this fucking guy giving these explanations of like, ah uh, yes, like, 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 if you're gonna lie or kind of give some things that are sussy information, they made many. But I guess is the only one that exists. That clearly, yep, definitely, yep, mm-hmm, yep. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yep. Yep. An anti-shadow weapon. Does that mean she has a persona too? Correct. Wow. I'm capable of wielding the persona called Palladian. Palladian. Oh, that's cool. She suffered major damage in combat that's cool. her first year out, and she's been kept in the lab ever since. I'm still not sure as to why she suddenly reactivated herself this morning. Right. Something to do in with In any me. case, I hope you'll all get along. An anti-shadow weapon, possessing a will all her own. Hmm. This is amazing! Huh. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, when we first saw you earlier, you were, uh, hugging our leader. <laughs> Do you know him? Yes, it is very important for me to be by his side. Why? Hmm. Maybe her facial recognition system is malfunctioning. Or maybe she's still half asleep. Very interesting. Oh, that's a fun idea, actually. Hmm. Half asleep? Well, I can ponder this later. <laughs> Anyhow, I forgot to mention. Did you know there are a wide range of recreational facilities you can use here? There's a tennis court, a pool table, and even a karaoke machine. No, no, don't do it. Don't do it. Would anyone care to hear me no, sing? No, 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 uh, no. My man's just going to sing like Weird Al Yankovic songs. You know it. Like that's that's all he sings. That's probably all he sings. Like like he he probably just he probably would just sing Weird Al Yankovic songs. Like that's that's <laughs> that's why he's the goat. <laughs> Day three of our vacation in Yakushima. <laughs> Man, uh, I can't believe it's already the third day of our trip. It's too bad we have to go home tomorrow. I'd totally stay longer if I could, but I can't complain too much. You went through a hell of a lot here. Yeah, like hearing you and the chairman singing. They I really skipped got it. Sleep last night. Do we have a mission at the beach today? Ah, yes we do. Nah, it's nothing like that. We just came here to have some fun. Do you understand what it means to have fun, I guess? Yes, I am informed of the concept. Recreation is sustenance for one's mental well-being. True. Yeah, exactly. Wow, True. you sure know a lot about us humans. All right, let's take one last dip before we leave. Uh, ah, she hey, just Nardo is it okay for I guess to go in the water? That's a good question. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, are you done already? It is best that everyone partake in this activity together. Yes. Deriving enjoyment alone is not the optimal method to have fun. Wow. <laughs> You've got some strong feelings on pretty well weird said. things, don't you? But what the heck, might as well. We 
should join them. <laughs> Agreed. Incoming anime cutscene. Enjoying yourselves. Quite a lot's happened during our time here. But it looks like we'll get to relax a bit today. <laughs> that would be nice. Sonata son! What are you doing? Come on, it's your turn! My turn? What? What are they doing? What? <laughs> Glad to see everyone's having so much fun. I've already told you what time the ship is arriving tomorrow, right? I'll probably head over to the port early. So don't be late. Okay. Okay. I'll let everyone know. We can get back to business once we've returned to the dorm. Got it. Hey, dude! Sonata son! <sighs> All right. I guess we should join too. Ah! I guess wait, that's not what water gun means! <laughs> Amazing! All right, here's our chance for an all-out attack. An all-out attack? All-out attack! Wait, time out! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I had a fun time with everyone in Yakushima. With Igus joining, things are likely to get livelier. Ah, nice. There we go. Hmm. <laughs> Done and dusted. <laughs> yes. Yeah, if they had a unique one for the whole group, that'd be awesome. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Uh-oh. He's catching plot. He feels left out of the main story, and he's feeling that compulsion to join. Uh-oh. You seem oh. to be in great pain. Oh, shit. You again. Again? Again? Okay, well, we have witnesses to whatever's about to happen here, so this is good. Oh, shit, it's them. You mean those three? Ugh, they're freaky. Oh, shut up. Let's get out of here. No, 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 no. Stay, 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 stay. <sighs> Why do they always run and hide at the sight of they're like back alley rats. You're, you're one to talk. <laughs> Beats me. Jin, give him the capsules. <laughs> Thanks. I'll pay you the usual way. Oh, shit. Now hold up. This time, we'd like your payment in the form of information. Your acquaintances have been busy lately. I'm referring to their activities on nights when the moon is full, of course. They've spent a great deal of time in the tower as well. I wonder, why did they take this burden upon themselves? Hmm. You do know, don't you? But you don't wish to say. Is it perhaps because... Uh. You're one of them? I'm not got nothing to do with them anymore then tell us I'm sure you'd agree these pills are more important than a group you have nothing to do with. that's good logic with whatever these pills are <laughs> I don't know the details but supposedly destroying all those creatures will put an end to the dark hour and that weird ass tower will disappear that's all I know all right you mean they intend to eliminate the Dark Hour completely. Why would they do such a thing? To give up such power? <sighs> to destroy the Tower of Demise. Hmm. Tower of Demise? Yeah. Who wouldn't want to take out that damn thing? <sighs> Takaya. Yes, I know. Can't go back. Okay. Huh. I won't use my power again. Not after last time. Hmm. Man, I'm beat. Seemed to take forever to get back. Oh, hello. Yeah, it was a tiring trip. Please rest up so you're ready for the next operation. Yeah. 
There are six more to fight, right? Just the last full moon shadows and things. Just the last full moon shadows and things will go back to normal. No more apathy syndrome incidents, just plain old everyday life. Let's do our best. After all, we're the only ones who can help. Okay. I guess. What's your deal? Speak. These are your living quarters. Very well, I shall remain by your side at all times. She's still far from passing as a human. Doesn't look like she understands ordinary feelings in conversation yet. She could, I might be able to form a bond with her. Oh, do we have to teach her things? That's cool. You see, hmm, is there something you'd like to know about Igis? Yes, yes, where are the others? I assume you were referring to the other anti-shadow weapons. Yes. Well, there were quite a few created. You could say they were Igis' siblings. However, they were all destroyed 10 years ago in the incident. I love how they're writing this incident. Everything was destroyed there. All the scientists were dead. We have no way of knowing all this stuff. Yes, we're just now revealing it. It's, it's such bullshit. It's such bullshit. It's like, ah, yes, yes. The thing, it, 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 it just, we don't have to think about it, yes. Which means there's clearly gonna be more of them. Like, there's clearly going to be some others that survived. There's clearly going to be more stuff that has to do with that moment. Like, we're already seeing, like, some of that with the way that uh, Mitsuru's father kind of added added more to our understanding of the incident. Yes. It's like in uh, Neon Genesis Evangelion, to, to draw our attention to that point. It's, uh, I'm not gonna spoil all of Neon Genesis Evangelion, but there's a reason why they call it the third impact. You know, so your brain naturally goes, I have a question, question. Um, what are the first and second impacts? Yeah, don't ask that question. Oh, okay. That'll be explained later. Okay. I guess it's been quite lonely since then. You see, why is she so human? Persona is a product of the human psyche. So the plan had been to place a human mind inside an anti-shadow weapon. The only real issue was the form that weapon would take. If they'd use a tank, for instance, the weapon's mind would recognize itself as such, and a contradiction would arise, as we all know a tank is not a living entity. A human mind trying to reconcile existence, its existence in this way would break down before you could blink. So how do we prevent that contradiction? You see where I'm going with this, don't you? Yes. When given a body that more closely resembles the expectation of the mind, the spirit stabilizes. And it's why Igis and her siblings were built in the form of human beings. You see? Sure. How come she knows me? Mm. I couldn't say. Perhaps it's a bug in her facial recognition programming. I'm sure it's nothing to concern yourself with. You're not worrying over much, are you? Well then why don't I ask the other question of who did she have to protect or be by before me that she might be mixing me up with? You see, she looks like a normal girl as long as she doesn't do anything too weird. But if she does, do you think anyone will figure out that she's actually a robot? Well, maybe not. Most people probably aren't on the lookout for undercover robots. That's true, that's true. She's super cute, huh? She's super cute. But made of steel. It's new territory for me. Honestly, I don't know how to approach this. <laughs> I like that he's just like, I don't know how to feel about that. But here we go. <laughs> It is morning. Oh. I request that you wake up. Okay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you have successfully awakened. Mission complete. Wait. The blue eyes. Oh shit. Is our sleep paralysis demon like her? Um uh, uh, uh my alarm clock. <laughs> It has not triggered yet. No. Five minutes early is on time. That is the phrase posted on the wall. So I will be <laughs> five minutes before your alarm clock engages. Thank you. Hey, are you awake? That girl disappeared and we can't find her anywhere. Can you help us? <laughs> oh my gosh. She have gone out on her own like she did in Yakushima. My name is not that girl. Please address me as I guess. Oh my gosh. I guess? When did you... I entered while he was asleep. Unlocking the door took two minutes. Two minutes? That's unlawful entry. Didn't we tell you to stay in the command room at night? 
I determined that it is ideal to be on standby in this room. Is this a problem? What? Where is this coming from all of a sudden? If there is a problem, I will address it promptly. <laughs> the problem? Well, it's probably against dorm regulations for one. Look, don't just stand there. Tell her. Um. Oh my god, the game giving me all these big decisions, you know? I have to pick one or two. I, I can't pick three. I gotta pick two. Two. You know she's not allowed in here. Okay, look. I'll get a room set up for you on the third floor so you can stay nearby. Just don't leave the dorm by yourself, okay? I will do as commanded. Yeah, okay. I'm tired. <laughs> All right, well, I have practice this morning, so I gotta get to school. Everyone here goes to a place called school in the morning. True. I comprehend. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's so, so freaking hot today, too. So I've been thinking. After we defeat all the shadows and the dark hour disappears, what's gonna happen then? I don't know. So. But regular I... people don't even know about the dark hour to begin with, right? That means no one will ever know what. Any, about anything we've ever done, or we've done. I mean, I get it'd be a huge problem if they did, but it just kind of sucks, you know? That's how it's gotta be. Hey, the exam results are up. I'm number one again. Hmm. Scored the highest in my grade. There it is, baby. Everyone is looking at me with respect. Ugh. Easy charm, baby. Oh, and it's rank five! Mm -mm -mm. Amazing. Come to think of it, Mitsuru promised to give me a gift if I scored well. I should talk to Mitsuru when I see her. All right. Let's do this. Hello, hello. Oh, Shoto Dono, exams have come to an end. We both fell out. Now my brain is exhausted. Shoto Dono, are you busy? To master the way of the kimono. I have need of your strength. Yes, indeed. I must so. Kazuchi Kenai, I am eternally grateful. Then today I shall sew as I have never served before. Sewing is my life. Yes. My wallet may be light, ah. and my materials may be cheap. Indeed. But my but passion. I will work out to make a beautiful kimono and save my future. We oui, we. Oui. I help Bebe work on the kimono. Ah. Kui, this is starting to come together. Manzoku. Manzoku. <laughs> when my uncle sees this, I know he'll agree with me about how great Nihon is. Ah, indeed. He'll definitely agree. I believe you, which means I must work even harder. Even harder. I made so much progress today, and I could not have done it without your help. Merci, arigato. <laughs> thank you. The triple thank you. Bebe seems truly grateful, but will he be back? Rank eight. Oh, my arms are so very tired. Ah. I must have overworked them. Oh no. No matter what's the cost, I will finish this kimono. Oh. For my future, for Nihon, I cannot give up now. Okay, be careful though. But, you know, take time to recover and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, espresso. Today's the day I finally returned the favor. Are you free? Yes. Yes. All right, then let's go. Hell yeah. All right. This time let's have a nice meal as we talk about our future battles. Okay, let's go. Where are we headed? as long as you're the one who gets to do the fighting. Ooh. He wants to talk about that. Hmm. Our future battles, huh? Hmm. Yeah, what's wrong? 
Uh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. First things first. Let's get some food. Hey, what's going on? Should we call somebody? There you are, Akihiko Sonata. Oh, shit. Whoa! Oh, you're the guys from before. Seven of them. Turns out you're pretty famous, huh? An up-and-coming boxer, that it? Time to pick up where we left off. Show me what you got. <laughs> Kicking your ass is gonna do wonders for our rep. No way we're gonna pass this up. The seven of us jumping you is gonna totally boost our rep. Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. Champ yeah. or not, look at our numbers. You ain't got a chance. Yeah, take him one on one. Boxes are tough, ain't they? What? You can't handle a challenge? You're welcome to join him, though, Pipsqueak. See? We're reasonable, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> you said beating me would do wonders for your rep. I thought this was about testing each other's strength. You idiot. I'm just gonna have fun kicking your ass because you're full of yourself. And who the hell cares about any of that as long as you win? Isn't that how you roll, too? <laughs> Looks like a fight is going to break out. I have to do something. So, you want to go first or what? <laughs> Get back. Officer, over here! Are you shitting me? Get back here! <laughs> hey, nobody runs away from us! Nobody runs away from us! <sighs> Running away is easy enough. It's losing them, that's the hard part. Still, made for a good workout, right? That was some quick thinking, by the way. Just what I'd expect from our leader. Not a problem. I don't exactly like turning my back to an opponent. But it doesn't matter in the end if I can't protect the ones beside me. And being outnumbered increases our risk of injury or damaging our surroundings. What I mean is, you made the right call. I owe you one. Okay. Yeah. Hmm? A box. It's addressed to me. It says it contains fruits, snacks, and beverages. Looks like it's from my parents. <laughs> I'll take it to my room later. Oh, there sure is a lot. Yeah. It's probably because they think I'm a growing boy and all that. I haven't nice. kept in touch lately since I'm so busy. But I should probably write back and thank them. I appreciate how much they care, but this is a little too generous. Wanna take some of it off my hands? And again, you'll hardly make a dent in this either. Hey, you can share with everyone. Good idea. Would you mind gathering everyone up? Aww. Oh, hi. Very intriguing. Show me. Oh, okay, okay, Everything good. Everything is such high quality. I can tell just by looking. Your parents must really care about you. Aww. <laughs> At least you know how to behave in front of your parents, Akihiko. Don't you ever have anything nice to say about me? <laughs> my parents have been good to me. I obviously haven't told them about what we do here, though. Hmm. Wow. When it comes to being considerate of others, you're a heavyweight. Glad to have you in our corner, senpai. There he goes again. <laughs> he sure looked good, though. Thanks for sharing, Sonata Senpai. Yeah. Take whatever you want. Oh. Hey, this you're just good really stuff. good. What's that? Oh, going for that this one, huh? Like you get that for royalty. You have my thanks. I took care of most of it. I'm surprised they were so happy. Hmm. I've really got to show my gratitude to my parents and to everyone here. Well, all this talk about my parents reminded me of some things from the past. Like, why I'm here right now. Okay. I guess I feel like I remember my reason for fighting. Glad to hear it. Well, don't mind me. Let's just say I've got a lot of room to grow. The dorm's gotten so much busier. The orphanage used to be something like this too. We all lived under the same roof having casual conversations. I'd forgotten what it was like, but it wasn't so bad. I remembered after uh. you suggested we share with everyone. 
Let's do it again sometime. Tell that to my parents. I really got to repay you in particular, though. Or we'll never be squared away. All right. It's pretty late now. I guess we should clean up and call it a night. Okay, okay. What? What's up? There's something mixed in here. It's a letter. It's some sort of handcrafted object. It's like a gold medal. It's made of cardboard. What? Is there something there? This is... Is it also a gift? No. This is mine. You won't understand what it means. Oh. But it's from a long time ago. Oh. Do you mind if I ask you something? You take on the role of our leader. And you're stronger than anyone else in your own right. That's more than just being talented. Where do you get that strength from? It's thanks to the bonds I have. Mm. Yes, indeed, indeed. Oh, I see. You mean you feel motivated because you have people in your corner? Bonds with others, huh? That might be something I'm missing. Mm. Well, whatever it is, you've clearly got something that I don't. The being jealous or trying to copy you isn't gonna help me. That strength is yours alone. I'm going to get stronger, but I'll do it my way. Sorry, we were supposed to be cleaning All up. All right. I'll take care of the rest. Things got so busy that I missed out on my chance to thank you again. Hopefully the food was enough for today. I'll invite you out again some other time. You better. Especially if we're not getting a social link with you. Okay, we got some tropical fruit. Interesting. Okay. I took Sonata's gesture of appreciation and returned to my room. I feel like my charm has improved after seeing how Sonata cares for his parents. Oh, cool. Awesome. Okay. All right. Oh. Uh, sure. It's about the track team. Since you just transferred, you probably haven't heard about the Mioho Cup, right? Well, let me Whoa. tell you. On August 2nd, there's a major competition for track and field. Okay. There's this guy named Hayase. Total speed demon. We can't let him trounce us this year. Got high hopes for you, so get ready to train hard. Okay. I'm gonna need you to show up from July 27th to August 1st. What? Don't go skipping school now. What? Got a special training regimen in mind for you. ISA won't stand a chance. Competition's on August 2nd. Let's do this thing. All right. You go! Hi! Oh, hey, Espresso Kun. Exams are finally over, huh? Congrats on surviving. Now we have time to do whatever we want to do. Are you busy right now? Those kids had their race and they said they want to talk to us. All right, let's do this. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. I'll go call them over then. Ah. I wonder how they did. Now I'm getting nervous. Coach and the boyfriend. Ha-ha. <laughs> Coach, we raced them all one-on-one -on -one and two of us actually won. Okay. That means we tied the sixth graders. Can you believe it? They no. said they're gonna let us use the schoolyard now. And they want to be friends with us. They think we're pretty fast for fourth graders and told us we should play together sometime. Aww. Oh, you guys. Yeah. I never had a doubt. I know how hard you all worked. Wow, thanks. Um, big sis? <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't have to call me that if you don't want to. Auntie Yuko is fine. Aww. One, two, three. Thank you, Auntie Yuko. Good luck with your boyfriend. Oh, not what I expected at all. <sighs> they called you my boyfriend till the very end. Nice. Want to make that true? Oh! Oh! <laughs> like, we got to. We got to. Bulls in. Okay, wait, huh? Hey, don't laugh. Joking like that is bad for my heart. Oh, you really got me saying something like that out of nowhere. You know what this feels like? The end of some cheesy high school drama series. She didn't like it though. Like the kids have left the nest. Ah. Uh, are you sad? 
now that it's suddenly so quiet. Yeah, a little. Although it was pretty tough at the beginning. Teaching those kids how to race. Aww. It was pretty fun. They looked so happy every time they got faster. And it made me happy too. That feeling of wanting to help them just kept growing bigger and bigger. You know, this might have been the first time I really put my heart into something. Oh shit, wait, 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 wait. There might have been a little bit of a slip there. Didn't they kind of bring up something that like just earlier she had broken up with somebody like before this? So she's basically saying she didn't even put her put her heart into that relationship. Oh, they said that was years ago. Oh, okay, never mind. That doesn't count. Yeah, that was a while ago. She broke up with a cheating boyfriend. Oh, that's right. Never mind then. Okay. And it's not that I've been slacking off as a team manager, but maybe helping and teaching people is more of my thing. Okay, yeah. Kind of made me think about the things I should do for my future, I mean. Oh, sure. Oh, by the way, I wanted to thank you. Maybe we should throw a little party. Let's do yeah. it, yeah. To celebrate our first attempt at coaching. Yeah, let's do it. Yay! Oh, I can't wait. Nice. Hmm, now where should we have the party at? I kind Burgers. of want to be somewhat fancy. I'll look around for a place. Burgers. Yuko is full of enthusiasm. I feel like our relationship has grown. She's trying to sneak in to ask us out on a date. Mm-hmm. Take us somewhere I fancy. I didn't have much confidence at the beginning. So you being here with me was really... Well, let's talk about that next time. We'll have plenty of time at the party. Shall we head home? Nice, nice. Did I get friends out? I don't think so. I don't think so. Left school with Yuko. Oh, again. Good evening. I'm pleased to see that you're well. All right. <sighs> Your pills. <sighs> I noticed once again that a new ally has been added to the ranks. Well, I suppose it's more of a pet than an ally. Makes no difference to me. <sighs> it seems what you told us of their intentions is true. How terrible. Now we have no choice but to intervene. Oh, here we go. It is up to the individual how to use the strength they are granted. But to erase the Dark Hour would be denying the very power they possess. Hmm. And that is the one thing we cannot permit. Fine. Do whatever you want. Hold up a sec. What's your role in all this? We know they asked you to come back. You know, you're really starting to piss me off, nosy little shit. <gasps> yeah? Well, they're going down, you hear me? And if you're on their side, then you're going down too. Got that? I already told you, I'm done with them. Hey! Um... Amada. My name is Ken Amada. I'll be staying here for a while. I'll try not to be a bother, so please don't mind me. Mm. Okay. 